This is Andrew Bermudis again, bringing you another exciting episode of Backstage Showcase. Now today, we are going to delve into something that I haven't really touched upon and is kind of easily look overlooked in the original material, but the particular thing that we're going to look at today is actually a location. The location that we're going to be looking at is the Windsor Hotel from Johnny Thunder and the Gift to the Nile. And interestingly enough, this hotel will also have a cameo appearance in Pharaoh's Quest, The Curse of Omset Ra, as its old British Officers Club form. Now, as you may have guessed, the Windsor Hotel is a real-life location. It is an actual hotel in Cairo, Egypt. The reason why I picked this location is because it's a location with a lot of history to it, and I felt that that was a good fit for Johnny Thunder and the Gift of the Nile, because there is a lot of history that's being represented in that film. I am not going to lie, though. When I was working on Johnny Thunder and the Gift of the Nile, I didn't do much research on the Windsor Hotel, so honestly, the one that you see in Gift of the Nile does not look at all like the one in real life. So I'm actually fixing this for Pharaoh's Quest, The Curse of Omset Ra, where I'm actually doing more research, seeing what the actual hotel looks like, and also thinking about another aspect as well, because like I mentioned, and as is mentioned in Giant Thunder and the Gift of the Nile, uh, the Windsor Hotel was once a British officer's club, and it was one up until 1954, which was when Egypt gained its independence. So one thing I have to think about is when working on Pharaoh's Quest, this is 1924. So this is still when the British own Egypt. So I have to think about how would it, how would it have looked different for that time period because it's serving a different purpose. When it came to designing the hotel, there were a few things I had to think about. First, in terms of the script, I had to think about how I would implement the two areas of the hotel that I knew I was going to represent the main entrance foyer, and two of the hotel rooms, which are interconnected. So from a practical sense, I had to think about that when building the set. But on another level, I also think about, I had to think about how it would be related to Egypt, how to make it feel like it's in Egypt. So when building the set for Gift the Nile, I used a lot of yellows. I used a lot of like tan, um, I use colors along those lines so that you get the sense of it being a, of it being more in a warm environment because yellow is a very warm color, but at the same time I didn't want to use a harsh color either because I wanted it, wanted it to be appealing to the eye and make it feel inviting. However, for Pharaoh's Quest, The Curse of Omset Ra, since I am doing the research that I should have done with Gift the Nile, and also since I'm focusing on a different part of the hotel, I'm really looking into how that hotel looks, um, what parts that hotel are reminiscent of the colonial days of Egypt, and what elements can be integrated. So, if you're not familiar with it, the Windsor Hotel has a more or less like a, a restaurant slash bar called the Barrel Bar. And I've been looking at photos of that, and I'm going to be using those photos in constructing that set for Pharaoh's Quest, The Curse of Omset Ra. And I'm going to use that in a way to figure out how to like make it feel still appealing, like I did with Gift of the Nile, but also how to make it feel more authentic, how to make it feel more like 1924, um, and also think about like uh, things like repetition, because one thing I notice is that there's like a repetition of shape in the barrel bar, lots of round objects, which would make sense um, considering the name. And also, I'd be thinking about all those different things and implementing that, and making it feel like part of Pharaoh's Quest, The Curse of Omset Ra, which as a movie is another film that I'm also looking at and making it a very warm movie for a lot of the same reasons I made Gift the Nile a very warm movie. So there wasn't a lot to talk about today, but I hope you enjoyed this episode of Backstage Showcase. If you enjoyed this episode and you want to see the hotel as it appears in Gift of the Nile, go to our channel and look up Johnny Thunder in the Gift of the Nile, or you can also look up the other episodes of Backstage Showcase. 
And don't forget to also check out our website at mustachemaniacsfilmco.webs.com where you can find all the other parts of our network such as our wiki, our Facebook page, our press room, and so much more. Thank you for joining me, and I'll see you next time.